Hey, this is another app review. It's basically really not an app. It's a it's a theme for your iPhone. You get it out of Cydia. And, it's, you know, I'm sure you've heard of Winterboard. Well, this is called Dreamboard. And this is just going to be a review on one of the themes that you can use with Dreamboard. Okay, first of all, we all know good old Cydia. I've already downloaded it, but I'll show you where it's at in Cydia. Wait till that loads. Um, I also, I've seen a number of videos that didn't show you how to change the city to, to your current weather. It was stuck at Cleveland, Oklahoma. Well, I'll show you how to change that too so you can um, make sure it displays your city's current weather and not Cleveland, Oklahoma. I thought it was Cleveland, Ohio at first until I looked into the settings and looked up the zip code it had and looked up that city and it said that's Cleveland, Oklahoma. So anyway, as soon as this gets through loading here, I hate this part of Cydia. It takes forever. Um, I think I'll cut this part out of the video, maybe. I may make you sit here and suffer through it like I'm doing. Alright, surely it's almost through. Then again, maybe not. Okay, I'm just going to type in Dreamboard up here. And see, you pick any of the any of their, those three there. I don't, I picked the last one, of course, and installed it. I heard that it was, they charged for it, but the one I downloaded was free. It let me download it, so I don't know if it's a hack version or what, but maybe it's free now. But anyway, once you download that, you also need to download, th this is an app, app review, God, I can't talk tonight, on N6 HD, so, and I also heard they charge for that, but it was um, also free too, so, you gotta have the, see with Dreamboard, you can add a lot more themes, and um, kind of like Winterboard, you can have all the themes, you just enable the one that you want, well, Dreamboard is a lot cooler than Winterboard, in my opinion, so let's say you went ahead and downloaded both of those. Okay, then you're going to load Dreamboard. So you got your different themes there. Uh, actually, this is the normal iPhone theme here. This is another one I've downloaded that I'll show you all later. It's not that great, in my opinion. Um, and then this one here, which is called Android. I thought it was called something else, but that's what it says right there. I'll show you that one later, too. But the one I'm going to show you is N6 and once you click on it you know once you've installed everything out of Cydia it takes a second to prepare it and as you'll see right here mine's actually showing Shreveport where I live and mine's not showing the Cleveland like all the everybody else's videos were showing but as you can see the cube turns which is really cool it looks really cool in person I don't know about on the video but you hit W and you can change the backgrounds You know, which they really look cool in person, like I say. I kind of like that one. And over here, if you hit the arrow, you can actually add apps into right here. Just whatever apps you want to add. I haven't tried to figure out how to do that yet. I'll do that on another video. You know, you've got different places for your different type of apps. Um, you know, of course, if you wanted to make a phone call, you'd hit phone. Or text, you hit text hit that right there and then there's all your apps that you have installed on your iPhone which you can see I've got like 285 or something like that I don't remember but uh, anyway let's see here also uh, if you want to get rid of you don't like the calendar you can take it off if you want it on top instead of on bottom, you see it's moved it up here like that. Of course, it looks better on the bottom. You can do the same thing with the cube. You can turn it off or you can move it down at the bottom, you know, and then you can move your calendar up there, which to me, I haven't tried that yet. Yeah, it looks better the other way. And um, that's what that's for. This right here, you got your dock programs 
in there that you can use. And the main thing I wanted to show you is how to get in there because this is a, a problem I've seen. I'm trying to get out all this. Uh, this is a problem just getting that off there. I haven't messed with it enough so I don't really know what I'm doing. What else is new? But anyway, how to get it where it shows your city and not Cleveland, Oklahoma. We will go to Dreamboard and get out of this app. Maybe. Okay, go to Dreamboard. We need to go to iFiles, what we need to go to. So I'll go back to my other regular theme and um, go to iFile. Okay. I'm going to start at the beginning so you'll know where to go. Okay, the first thing you do, you go to VAR. And then, I believe you go to Mobile. After that, you go to Library. Then you look for the Dream Board. After that, you look for the, the theme, which is the N6, the one I just showed you. If you once you change the N6, it uses the same file for the other colors of N6 if you want to use like the cranberry color or the green color so you just need to go to the main N6 then go to widgets and then go to clock and here you go to widget HTML you want to text view it and in this file you're gonna find a zip code that's 74020 well you're gonna find that in this text file which is pretty far down and you're going to put your zip code in there. So basically, let me see if I can find it. I know it's right up in here somewhere. Let's see, I don't know if you can see it, but right there it says weather script. And then right there, see 71118? That's my zip code. It originally had 74020 in there. So once you change it to your zip code, it will show your weather. It'll show what city you live in instead of Cleveland. And it'll show your current weather. So I'll put that link in the description that way. You'll know how to get there because sometimes it's hard to pause a video and go through it like that and try to find it. But other than that, this, this, this is a really cool theme for your iPhone. If you get it, you won't be disappointed. I would show you some of the other ones, but you know... I'll make separate videos for the other things because some people might not be interested in 19 different themes in one video. So, but anyway, check it out. Dreamboard. Let me show you again. Like say, like that was the uh, blue one I showed you. Let's say you wanted purple. Which it don't really look like it goes as good to me with the cube. But right now it's preparing the theme. As you can see, maybe right there. Uh, I don't have much light right now. Well, I have some light, but it's not as good as daylight, so I don't know how clear this video is going to be. But basically, this just gives you a different color. See, right now, you can see where it says Cleveland, but that will change as soon as it gets through preparing. See, it says Shreveport. And right now it's 9.26 p.m. at night, and it's 95 degrees here, if you can believe that. We've been, we have a heat wave going on. That's, it's been over 100 degrees for like two months now. I, I don't even know how long anymore. It's been forever. But anyway, if you like this app, it's Insidia. you got to have a jailbroken iPhone. Um, people said it costs money, but it I downloaded it without a problem. And I didn't see a version where you could even pay. I looked for the paid version because I was going to buy it. And there's no paid version in my city. It's just the free version. So, Oh, and also the lock. You hit the lock. Hit that. Hit that. Hit that. And then hit the lock. And that unlocks the screen where you can do different things. Which actually, to me, it doesn't look like it does anymore. Unlocked. Then it does lock, to tell you the truth. But, but anyway, please like. Please comment and please subscribe. Thank you.